my view is that we have a responsibility as corporate America to create an environment that helps foster a, a desire on the behalf, behalf of employees to be healthier. My sense is that we provide the proper environment that helps that employee understand the value of being healthy. And it's not just healthy today or tomorrow, it's healthy for the long term. The mission statement for the wellness program is, again, to provide our employees and their families with a culture that encourages healthy lifestyles. And the benefit of that is not only more satisfied and more healthy employees here under our roof, but healthier families at home. And ultimately, because we are so community driven, ultimately a healthier community as well. As a family owned company, we have the um, responsibility and the obligation and, and the, the uh, culture that really treats our employees as part of the family. Uh, and being part of the family, we, we care about them, we care about their well-being, and so the, the things that we do, the programs we have in place, the, the, the way we manage the business is with the employee in mind in terms of creating a great opportunity for them. Now, the, the, the business sense side of that is that 65% of our employees sell their time. So part of what our business is is selling the labor of those employees as they work on, on the various parts of our business. So that is the engine of our growth is, is in our employees. And so you get a benefit if you create that culture that supports the employee and creates a great environment for them. They're happy to be here. We get a quality result from their work effort. In terms of how our wellness program impacts the business, aside from the financial uh, control of health insurance costs, I think because we are so focused on customers, the fact that we've improved satisfaction levels of the employees, and part of that comes from offering stress management programs, offering fitness facilities on site, or nutrition or um, health consultations on site, when the employees are happier, not only uh, are they healthier and they go home healthier, but they treat our customers better. So if they can be, if the employees can be happier at the workplace, and they go home happier, they come back happier, that, that is conveyed to the customer. The customer senses that and they comment on our wellness program and our culture. The goal clearly is to have a happy employee that can be working on a customer's airplane that can provide the best absolute quality result that we can provide. And so the result of that then is a happy customer. And so if you look at you know, how, how you approach the business here, if we create an environment where employees are happy and healthy, feel good about coming to work and, and, and they don't uh, run out of energy in the middle of the day, they're going to provide a higher quality result for our customers and we're going to have happier customers and hopefully repeat customers. So it all kind of ties that circle together. And what we found is that in the year 2002, which is when the formal wellness program launched, we were seeing an average of almost 23 percent increase in a health insurance plan per year for an indiv individual. After five years of a formal wellness program, we're down to less than three percent. It's fun to take customers on tours because in invariably uh, what we try and do is, is we stop along the way uh, and, and look at somebody working on an airplane or an avionic box or repairing a landing gear. And we ask that employee to kind of tell us what they're doing. And with, without exception, the employee is excited about talking about what they're doing. They're, they get engaged with the customer, so it really you get that sense of energy and sense of commitment to their job.